Yeah man, what well, go on? From here the voice, you know it's another top shelf review, you know it's another top shelf update. People what well, go on? A brand do you know? You know, so today man, some things more for talk about still. Mm-hmm. So here I well, go on, make sure you see you like the video, make sure you see you share the video. I'm going to talk about some things we already know. I'm going to add some new information to you where you already know. And probably I'm going to make you know a whole heap of things today. Zim. Alright, so the first topic we're going to talk about is Skeng versus Squash. Now, I already did do a live stream on this one. I talk about that issue already. And I explain, say, really and truly, I don't want that thing to go beyond the music. Which it already start from beyond the music and it look like it will end up be in a music. If you get to me, I mean. Now there's a situation taking place over there in Trinidad with Trinidad. It's an offshoot of dancehall. Get to me, I say, mix with rap, trap, dancehall, a bag of things mix up. Money, badness, everything. You have a particular artist um, by the name of K Man 6. He has been banned from two Caribbean countries now. Him and one of them were involved in it. And he, him is a six. Now, I'm not too sure of the links between the Jamaican six and the Trinidad six. But to my understanding, there is some link. The six from Jamaica start from Moby, a squash thing. And you know, Chronicler part of that. You know, Javelani was a part. You know the six thing from 2019. Trap dance all. Um, the producer them where they found. You know that wave there from 2019, 2018 and thing. And the six has steadily maintained them name in a dance hall from them time there till now until it end up reach over Trinidad. But there's a thing I go on with the badness and the six in a Trinidad and they have a next group with name seven. Yeah man, six and seven. So may I tell you, them have a particular saying where them say things is sixes and seven, you know. Which kind of means a hell broke loose basically. You get to me as a confusion that take place. But the thing is with a clash here and a feud here is that there is something about rur and screw. You see me? So. Why I say I'm a screw? Rur. The killer sick like flow. Rur. Not a screw. Not a screw. Hey boy! It was that thing there where did I go on? Where skeng them say her skr and you know squash them and say her not a skr. You see me and that little thing that they are going for some time where people are speculating and I say I wonder if them are go at it. But it's like skeng align himself with the seven group in a Trinidad. And of course you know say squash say six. So it's like it are coming like say not coming like Skeng a follow a group where in a Trinidad. Squash originate a group in a Jamaica and it end up spread to Trinidad. Already they say it look like say Skeng a follow and Squash a originator. At the end of the day, if two of them clash, probably that will matter. Probably it won't. Yes, me, but the thing for me is a lot of concerns with this. But before me get to the concerns, I could talk about what take place. And Skeng did put out a snippet of one song recently where he said, Knock it pan a six. I must say, I'm belly big. I can't even run. But Skeng got a step further recently. I'm going to show you right here. So now. Hey, man. So if you miss it, let me explain to you why Skeng just do this a while ago. You hear him said knock it on them in a them hometown. And him said, look out this in Miami. Miami is a place where most people have it says squash reside. That's how we for squash live. You get to me, I say? So when you hear him say knock it on them in a them hometown. And say, her skirt. You get me, I say, I squash him at that directly. So, so he must say, him found a squash place and this him in them place. That he must say, right there. So, and of course, a brother, you know, one of them producer. You get me, I say, or who we'll link with him from such time and produce for him too. Can't remember his name right now. I mean, I think of Buddha. I don't remember his name. But leave in the comment section because I know he's over here so knowledgeable. 
You see me? So, that's the message. And we know say, this is not the first time Skeng would have do something like this. I don't even remember before when Skeng did that tease the clash with Massacre. He got the swamp and said, poop, poop. When you come out, no? come out. No? As in, if you say, I draw out Massacre. If you say, I got the swamp, you know, Massacre a crocodile. So, this will not be the first time he might do a style like this. Pull up at somebody's place of dwelling and say, yo, we there, you know, we there at your door. You see me? Step out. Where you dip on? So, Skeng again has shown bravery and show a willingness for entertain a dance hall, clash in a dance hall. And a whole heap of we love that. A whole heap of we in a dance hall love the dance hall clash. We, we see two already. Come like we get spoiled for that year. We get, we get two in a January. And if you don't mind, child, one might go on a February now. What are your thoughts surrounding Skeng versus Squash? Because that look like it up on the horizon right now. For me, I me don't mind it. I would like it to be a bad thing in terms of entertainment. But it would also be a bad thing in terms of the crime and how people view and perceive dancehall. And people are going to say, if the crime turn up more in a trend, they are going to hear it because of the two Jamaican them. We a clash of them and frig out. And then now you're going to hear Sir P and a bag of people. People, look at your screen. You see, this is a city culture that we're talking about. There you have two of the most talented dancehall or talented dancehall artists. <laughs> people, that I'm Sir P impersonation. When we can't do good. But that's the thing where you're going to hear. And you're going to hear, say, oh, they want to tear down dancehall and they make crime rate go up. Da 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 da. Dancehall fuck up the place. And you know how it go already. Well, election will come up, so probably them now go, go so hard upon the dancehall because they want to dub on them something. But you know how it go. Dancehall get blamed for criminality. And me just not want it to reach there. So if it can stay in a clash music terms, me nah no problem with that. Uh, entertainment, who for dead, dead, who buy the coffin lyrically. Lyrically, emphasis, and lyrically. And what does deal with it? You see me? But I don't want it to be a case where it's spill over in the street and your ears say dance all like as criminality and them something all kind of something. Because as what I say, I said, it kind of start from already with six verses seven. And at the end of the day, too, it's like, I don't know, I don't know if King going to say seven. Seven ratty or uh, ratty seven. Probably I say about the car. Everybody when them a clash, they want to put in the name of uh, 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 them, uh, uh, them team. You see me? Yeah, and for make it seem musical, probably the wise if Skeng say ratty seven or something. Put in theme movement in there. For no make it seem like it's just a gang war spill over into music. We see them some go on a music in a Chicago, you know, on the drill scene, you know. And we see artists drop out and them thing. Now we know why that reach in a dance hall. Most time dance hall clash go on, artists show what and so we never see nobody. You see me, I say? Get analyzed. You see me, and we don't want our music reach this. So, so would I love it stay musical. As well, I tell you, even you, when you came on six, in band from two Caribbean country, them now want to see him at them place. And it really assures that the music have a bad name on it right now as it relates to the violence and the clashing and the gang, you see me? So it's King I make that move there. It possibly say Squash might pull something. Squash might drop a song. We don't know what might happen. You get to me and say it can go anyway. People, now get me wrong, I love the entertainment, I love the clash, I love the review, I love the live stream, I love the views. Lovely little ad sense we might come off it and the like and you see me the vibes but me no love here about the, 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 the war and the street thing cause people are real people are lose real life and I get hurt and I have to run up and down and people are get misplaced you see me I say and for a, 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 a era of music where people knock and say this and not go nowhere me no want them add this to it as well I don't want them to add it to it as well. So I would implore, I would beg the man them keep it musical. If you don't exercise on the musical prowess, do so against each other. We don't have no problem with that. You see me? Yeah. But I don't want it to reach to that level. That's all I say.